higher even shivendu here so as you might know the 10th standard books of maharashtra state board have been released so you can get them at your nearest book retailer so i bought this book and here it is this is a science and technology part 1 book of the two part series of 10th standard and i find it a little bit what you can say more attractive than the previous designs and also that this syllabus as you can uh, tell by the table of contents it is more or less aligned nowadays to the ncert syllabus so it's good to know but there are some things that i find like a bit odd like there are just like some mistakes in the books so i have not read the entire book but i have read through the first chapter and i also reviewed the what you can say the overview of the whole book and uh, i found one thing that was like just wrong so as you can see on page number 4 of the textbook in the gravitation chapter there is this paragraph that says that the regarding the law of gravitation and uh, as you can see i have highlighted here i'll just bring it a little bit closer so you uh, you can see this line in your own textbook and it is available online too so what it says is that in case when the bodies are not spherical or have a irregular shape then the direction of the force is along the line joining their centers of mass and d the distance is taken to be the distance between the two centers of mass so this uh, line is not perfect this if you do this you will just get the wrong answer now the proper method to solve this problem is that you need to take the integral of it don't worry if you don't understand what the integral is if you want i can make a video on that too but it's just not covered in the entire what you can say if, if you look to the whole book there's no way you can even find the word integral what does the government want us to do just what you can say they don't cover it in their syllabus and many of us we don't like to put wrong answers in our paper but if we write the correct answer will the examiners check it correctly or will they just take the formula from the textbook and one mark gone so comment down below what you think i will show you the proof now the other fact is that as you can see there are qr codes printed on the last page of every chapter so like this one you can see now if you don't know what a qr code is you can check out my other video on which i covered qr codes and how to use them and just click right here it should be right here so these qr codes are a nice strategy i think they contain some type of uh, link to the material but they are not working like if i get my phone right here and scan this it just redirects to nowhere so as you can see here i have a qr code scanning application so to scan i will just point it at this qr code and scan it like this now it shows this url now see where it redirects me It redirects me to this page where it says the website is just under construction now what what is this seriously these uh, the publishers need to what you can say the government the state government needs to update this this is not fair like the books are published they should have prepared it beforehand so i think this is what i uh, find a little disconcerting so comment down below what you think and if you find any more mistakes please comment down below so i can know and uh, so as as i progress through the book i will continue to review the book and after that i will uh, keep posting more videos regarding each lesson and if you guys want anything like assistance regarding a chapter or you find something uh, a bit too hard then you can always leave a comment down below and i will try to make a video on that topic So please subscribe if you like this video and keep learning bye